I'm alive. You shouldn't move so suddenly, Era. You're still in recovery, after all. Well, at least let me sit up from the bed. Uh, Taya? Hello again, Era. It's been a while. Uh, a while? To you, it's been only a few minutes. Seconds, even. But after she saved you, you've been in a coma for almost a month already. It's been a month? Yes. It took a while healing you as well. It's a good thing that she had a lot of connections. I... Please, don't worry. Your condition is getting better. But it'll take time for you to fully recover. Even now, there's probably still the after effects, right? <sighs> yeah. It was indeed horrible. <sighs> I can still feel it even now. Although it's not as much as there was before. <sighs> that uneasiness remains. She was really worried about you. She... <laughs> Where is she? Please, calm down, Era. Moving so much might make your injuries worse. So please, refrain from doing sudden movements. I just... I just need to. Don't worry. She's okay. She's just resting in another room, as of the moment. Rather, we forced her to sense... She's been overworking herself lately, taking care of everyone at dawn, and when night comes, she goes back to you. She hasn't been able to sleep that much either, which is why we went ahead and forced her to take a rest. <laughs> Being a busybody as always, isn't she? She's even neglecting herself now. She wouldn't actually leave by your side the first few days after that happened. What? What do you mean by that? She was protective of you, Era. <laughs> and how is that so? She wouldn't let anyone touch you. Oh. Not the doctors. Not the nurses. Uh -huh. Oh. Already claiming what's hers, perhaps. I've always known she cared a lot about you. However, during that time, she was afraid. Despite being called as a fearless hero before, she... At that moment, her eyes were filled with so much frightfulness, afraid that if she left you, something may happen again. At first, it was okay, and we could understand where she was coming from. But later on, she could barely eat nor sleep, since she was so focused on taking care of you. We had to have a talk with her about it, and convince her to take care of herself more. She's doing all right now these days, but it's still the same with her not being, with her not allowing anyone to touch you except her. She's being careful and trying not to take any risks. But I'm glad that you've regained consciousness now, Era. She'll probably, no, she'll be over the moon once she wakes up. And she realizes that you're now awake. I... I was that much of an inconvenience. I've even brought her pain. No, Era. You didn't. She just... cares so much about you. She kept telling herself she should have done better. But... We all know she did what she could. And she even saved you. <laughs> she did. She didn't only save me, but... Everyone as well. But I'll still make sure to give her an earful for not taking care of herself. <laughs> but Zaya, yes, I'd like to thank you too. If it weren't for you, I never would have gotten a second chance. That's... Of course, Era. You should give yourselves credit, though. Thanks to the both of you, the Academy's downfall has started. And everyone is starting to see the truth behind their facade. They've actually closed down ever since then. And thanks to her, we've finally taken a big step for a better future. Thank you 
for allowing that to happen, Zaya. You were still the one who made that happen, though. You chose to give me a chance. You chose this despite it all. It makes me curious, though. Why did you risk it all? I... Not to mention, I do recall the headmistress saying she can't control people who are deeply in love. Th that is... <laughs> so who is this lucky person? Uh, oh, wait. Is it actually? Er, can this be our little secret? Doya, I'm sorry. Please, don't be. Being by her side is enough for me. I risked it all because I knew she could do it. And if being right next to you makes her happy, that much makes me reassured that I was the reason that was made possible. You should at least tell her, you know. It helps. I'm alright. I'm happy just being there for her. Don't worry. I'm satisfied with the choice I made. Please, take care of her. I'm rest assured that it's you. Are you sure about this? I can tell. Because I've seen how she is when she's with you. She is the happiest when she's right next to you. I'm sorry, Zaya, but I... So please, don't feel guilty. I'm wishing you both the best. I'm here for both of you. Whenever. Thank you, Zaya. It seems that she's taken quite a while. Hmm? No, perhaps she's still taking a nap. Oh. And there she is. <laughs> Hi, darling. I'll leave you to be. Oh, wait, Doya, please keep what we talked about a secret. Era, <laughs> don't worry. I will. Please excuse me. <laughs> Hello there, my hero. Uh, oh, uh, no, no, it's okay. I can take this much pain. You see, I have high pain tolerance, so it's okay. <laughs> you can hug me as much as you want. Just uh, be a bit gentle for now, okay? <laughs> Come on now, darling. <laughs> Don't cry. I'm not going anywhere this time, okay? I mean, I physically can't. <laughs> oh. uh, hey, stop overreacting, darling. You're treating me as if I can't take a little pain. I'm fine. Now that you're here, I'm feeling alright now. If only I had the strength to punch you right now, I definitely would. You haven't been taking care of yourself lately, haven't you? You're always like this. Please take care of yourself more. But hey, now that I'm here, I'll do as much as I can for you. Although I do need some time to recover. Oh, that's so sweet of you to say. You'll take care of me, darling. <laughs> but you've already done so much for me. Thank you for saving me. Really. Thank you so much for everything, darling. You're my hero. And everyone's hero. Come on, stop looking so sad. Everything's going to be okay now. I'm sure of it. You'll make this world a better place. You're the hope that this world needed. And I'll be here, right here beside you. Supporting you in every way I can. <laughs> I love you too, darling. From your warmth to everything about you. I love you so, so much. You're my everything. And it will remain that way, now and forever. <laughs> hey, are you tearing up again? <laughs> I 
I can't exactly move my arms that much to help you wipe your tears, so... Will a kiss suffice? <laughs> You're so greedy. I mean, that's understandable, though. You missed me a lot, didn't you? <laughs> Don't worry. I missed you, too. So, so much. As much as I want to do more. Um, let's wait until I fully recover, okay? <laughs> oh, calm down. I just got a bit out of breath from that passionate kiss of yours, don't worry. Hey, <laughs> don't worry. We have all the time in the world. What is it? Oh? What about my hair? Oh. Oh. It's lost its color. Hey, darling, stop apologizing. Do I look that horrible with white hair? I mean, it still does look good on me, right? Don't worry about it. Hey, at least now I can say that I still love you even when my hair is white, right? <laughs> Come on, I'm just trying to lighten up the mood. <laughs> there you go. That's the smile that I love so much. Please take care of me from now on as well, darling. <laughs> I love you, darling. Let's do our best to make this world a better place for everyone, okay? Oh. <laughs> Can't we just cuddle for the moment? Oh. I can handle a little pain. What do you take me for? I've almost died twice. <laughs> I'm only kidding. <laughs> oh. Oh, you're holding back so much, aren't you? I can tell. Now be a good little girl and be patient for me for the meantime, okay? <laughs> for now, just embrace me like this. I love your warmth. <laughs> I love you so much, darling. 